Uh, Callum here for Full Time Devils, and we're outside the Etihad, and I'm with uh, John. John, what do you think of the game? Oh, disappointing, wasn't it? You know, to, to win on the night and, and not go through. Um, you know, it wasn't a brilliant first half, but we managed to come away with the goal. Uh, you know, De Gea kept us in, uh, but yeah, to you know, to finish the, the night, he, uh, you know, winning but to not going through. I think the damage was done first leg, wasn't it? Yeah, it really, was. yeah, it really was. But I thought it was De Gea brilliant again in the first half. I did think the midfield played really badly in the first half, in particular. I know City got through the lines quite a lot. What did you make of the midfield tonight? Yeah, I thought Fred played really well again today. It was a shame for Matic. He literally made two tackles, but for both of them, and he sent off. And, then, and, and City were doing it all game, especially on Jesse, three or four times, not a single card. But they're the masters of the cynical foul, aren't they? Yeah, well, Pep's always lauded that cynical foul, even though he denies it happening, doesn't he? <laughs> I think, uh, what did you make of the forwards? Do you think there was enough created for Marshall tonight? I know Bruno Fernandes has obviously been announced. Do you think that'll help us, or do you think it's, it's just a one step in the right direction, but more is needed? Yeah, he's one step in the right direction, 100%. Yeah, Martial was isolated, really, when he didn't have uh, his three done on scraps, really. Uh, it's disappointing. Um, but I was surprised we brought Greenwood off. What did you make of that? Because I know James probably could have brought something a little different with a bit of pace and more counter-attacking threat up front, but did you think that was the right decision? Possibly possibly not. No, I'd have um, maybe taken Shaw off, um, kept Greenwood on. Uh, have two up front with James on the right, yeah, th that would have been a more attacking option. I'd like to have seen Matter a little bit earlier, I think. I thought he might have been able to be that creative force that we've got. I mean, we seem to get sick of seeing uh, Lingard and Pereira being swapped for each other. Do you not think uh, Matter should have been brought on a little bit earlier? Definitely, yeah, it'd have been ideal in this type of game. And I don't know why he didn't take that free kick. I know Fred obviously uh, had, had, had first call, but that, to me, was ideal for Matter. Yeah, I th Fred seems to get a lot of uh, chances at goal, and he's—I uh, think he's got one of the worst conversion rates in the in the league for um, for shots outside the box. Uh, do you think it's time that maybe Fred was, uh, you know, maybe dropped a little deeper and stopped trying to push forward to get that shot from outside the box? What do you make of that? Possibly, but I don't think he had a single shot tonight, did he? He was—he uh, he was passing that uh, passing that final ball through. So you think he did? He had one shot, apparently. Alex said. <laughs> what do you make of tonight? No. Uh, not good, not good. I thought, I thought we could sneak over in the final ten minutes, but it's it's it's, it's just hard to, to not go through when when we were so good in that first half. Yeah, definitely. I thought the first half could have been a lot better. Midfield again, I think might have let us down, but. I think the defence, uh, to keep a cliche at the Etihad, is definitely something that we should be lauding. I think the defence did well. I know there was one or two mistakes uh, from Maguire, but we managed to recover. City seems to just ca try and keep passing it in the net, I thought. What did you make of the uh, defence tonight? Yeah, the, there was times we were trying to play it out the back of the second half. I was absolutely screaming at them. I don't know why we were trying to put ourselves under pressure immediately. We did that in the first leg. And we didn't seem to learn from it. I, I said to the cameraman, you know, we kept getting caught out, and I think our midfield isn't good enough, personally, to pass it from the back. I thought, you know, there was a few opportunities to lump it upfield and sort of, you know, just try and put City up under a bit of pressure. It's just a bit of a shame. But I think with the new mid, I think, you know, like you said before, Bruno Fernandes is a good step in the right direction. A couple more midfielders, and I think that it's obvious Ollie wants to play out from the back, and it's, it seems to be constant. Get those extra midfielders in, and I think you know we might see a real improvement in the uh, in the new season. Um, but you know, I think we've got to sort of look at something different. What do you think? Yeah, I'd, I'd say that. Yeah, you know, I agree. Probably playing out the back is the right way, but you can't do it when you've not got the personnel. In my opinion, yeah. you know, you can't. <laughs> we're, we're trying to play in a particular way when we, when we can't. To me, you just can't do it. Yeah. Well, um, it's just it's just a shame we won the game, and uh, but unfortunately, it's not gone through. It's a shame about Marchi's red card as well. I mean. It, you know, he, he just didn't, see, didn't seem to get any leniency from the referee, but it seems to be a common thing for United sometimes, doesn't it? I mean, I'm sure if we mention another team, they probably would have got away with it, but we're not going to do that here on this fan come, are we? Anyway, John, right, lovely to speak to you, mate. Oh, thanks a lot, Thanks mate. for that. Cheers.